Welcome back to another nutrition tip with Nancy. In my previous video, I talked about electrolytes, what they are and why they're important in the human body. Today, in this video, I want to tell you about replacing them and whether or not you need to worry about replacing them. If you sweat a lot during physical activity, and if you're going to have sustained physical activity for more than 60 minutes, you probably do need to replace your electrolytes. I'm a food first dietitian though, so I'm always going to tell you how to do it with real food rather than some kind of sports drink. So let's say you've been exercising for about 20 minutes, you've worked up a really good sweat and now you're taking a break. First thing, you're going to drink some water. And then you're going to want something salty. Why? because the majority of the electrolytes lost in sweat is sodium chloride. That's why your sweat tastes salty. So you need to replace the sodium. My favorite way to do that is by taking some small tomatoes, I like the Campari type of tomato, and salting them and then eating maybe a quarter of a tomato, a half a tomato, and that will help then replace the sodium lost in the sweat. If you want to try to replace some other nutrients, that tomato is going to also replace some potassium because there are good sources of potassium. You can also try a handful of salted nuts. You could have some kale chips. Kale chips are generally salted and then kale is also a source of calcium and it has a small amount of potassium. Everybody knows that banana is a good source of potassium, but if you just depend on having a banana during the activity, you're not going to replace the sodium that's lost. You really do need to focus on having that sodium replacement as well as some of the other nutrients. After you're completely finished exercising and you want a recovery thing, maybe a cup of yogurt with some nuts, seeds, those are great ways to replace calcium and potassium. If you have any questions about physical activity and nutrition, please give me your comments and I'll see what I can do to answer them in upcoming videos. Thank you.